Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try this Marie Callender's. This is the chicken pot pie. This is tender white meat chicken, um, golden flaky crust made from scratch, just like home. It's kind of weird it has it in that lettering right there, but that's okay. Um, I'm going to show you everything on the front. You can microwave these. If you want to, I'm not going to do that. I'm actually going to put it in uh, in the oven just because I'm, I'm at home and I can. Let's see the calorie information. There are two servings and they're 430 calories, so 860 calories if you eat the entire thing, which is a lot. Um, I don't think I ate all of the last one, so it's okay. If you want to do it in the microwave, you basically take the top off, put it in the microwave for nine to ten minutes, and then let it sit for five minutes. So really cooks pretty quick. Honestly, about 10 minutes. On the other hand, if you bake it, 400 degrees, um, leave pot pie in paper tray. That's interesting. Oh, leave it in paper tray, but take it from the box. Sorry, I was reading that wrong. Wrap the crust edge with a strip of aluminum foil so it doesn't burn. Bake on a cookie shape for 63 to 65 minutes. Wow. Big difference between 60 to 63 and, or 63 to 65 and 10. But um, I think it'll be crisper if you do it in the oven. So, so anyway, I'm gonna the oven's on. It's preheating. I'm gonna get this uh, prepared and get it in the oven, and then I'll be back when it's out. I just want to show you real quick. I just wrapped the uh, aluminum foil around the edges just so it won't burn, and um, I just got a, a, a strip about that wide, the whole length. We buy the extra wide aluminum, so stuck that all the way around, and, um, and now I put it in the oven for. 63 minutes so it literally takes an hour but it doesn't look like anything's baked and it's frozen hard as a brick now if you were to microwave it you literally just leave it in this container pull this lid off leave it in the container you microwave it for 10 minutes and and you're done so but i'm afraid it would not be crispy because i pot pies are not any good soggy so i want it crispy so i'm gonna get this in the oven and i'll let you know what it looks like in an hour okay here it is out of the oven i'm gonna actually break this just to let it cool off a bit because it gets very hot but it's good and crispy um, I like the crust to be on the, in the top to be in there anyway. Um, looks good and creamy. Um, looks like it has a lot of, a lot of chicken, lots of veggies in there. It smells really good. Um, yeah, it smells really excellent actually. Um, so I'm going to let this cool off because it is very, very hot. It has been in the oven for an hour, literally. Um, I took it out at 63 minutes. I just left it in just the minimum amount of time. It was fine. Um, so I'll be back when that's cooled off a little bit and I'll let you know what it tastes like. All right, I'm going to try it out and I'll let it cool off just a little bit. And there's no way I can get a bite of every little thing in here, but I want to make sure I get some chicken, um, a little bit of veggies, maybe some of the crust. Uh, if I can find a piece of crust I can find. There we go. It's still pretty hot. The crust is excellent. It's a really good buttery flavor and crust. Uh, flaky, really, really good. The chicken has this huge chunk of really tender chicken. The um, the vegetables are good. To really, the vegetables are kind of overpowered by the the sauce and the crust. Honestly, the vegetables just play a minor role. Now, I'm not a big fan of carrots, so excuse me, I spit. Um, I'm not a big fan of carrots, so you know the carrots are okay. I'm, you know they're there. You can taste them. Um, but everything's cooked well. They're not hard. They're, they're cooked softly. Um, they're not squishy, but they're soft. Um, really good pot pie. If you like pot pies, you've never tried them Marie Counters, you ought to grab one and see if you like it. They have all kinds of different flavors. Um, grab the one you like the best and try it out because I think you'll really like it. Um, like I said, I don't know how well they work in the microwave. I'm afraid to try one in the microwave. I'm afraid that it wouldn't be very crispy. Uh, they'll be cooked, but they won't be crisp. And I like mine crispy. So um, on a rating... I would give it a five for flavor because it's really, really good. Bad thing is I got to knock it down to a three just because of the overwhelming amount of calories. 800 and some calories for one pot pies is a lot for me to eat at one time. So I wouldn't want to eat that many calories all the time. I wish they'd make a miniature version of a pot pie. Maybe a 400 calorie version, like a half a size version, a portion, smaller portion size. Um, I wish they'd make one of those and I would probably eat that for lunch. Uh, 400 calories I can deal with. 
Um, so anyway, yeah, so overall, I'd probably give it a four overall. So uh, thanks for watching.